the Trinidad and Tobago stalwart goalkeeper Marvin Phillip has announced his retirement from the international game. Ken Fuentes spoke to Phillip. With over two decades of representing Trinidad and Tobago football at various levels and over 90 senior caps to his name, Marvin Phillip has called the time on a glittering international career. But why hang up his gloves and boots at this time? It's not a, a really tough decision, you know. I had reached my potential with sharing what I had for Trinidad and Tobago, you know. I don't feel I no longer could, 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 could do it anymore. I'll be still available for playing locally, that is, any local professional level, you know. I don't think the demand for national football, I don't think the body could take it. So international football, the body could take it anymore. He believes the future of goalkeeping in Trinidad and Tobago is in safe hands. It's no secret that, that, that we produce. We have been producing great goalkeepers, you know, I'm, I'm very confident there's a great bunch coming up locally, so I don't think we, we our goalkeeper, our goalkeeping um, is in great hands at the moment. I don't think we should be worried about it at all. Philip would have played with several players in the national setup over the years and paid tribute to those who would have impacted his career. Definitely, definitely. Um, Kenwin Jones, you know, we both started at the, 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 the same level, you know, and throughout my career, you know, he had been... been been very supportive. I would like um, the C's Clyde, Clyde Leon. You know, he had a he had a lot, he was influential as well with a lot of advice and whatnot. We went to school together. I must mention um, Denzel Teobol, you know. Denzel looked after me at a, a certain time when I was in the national team, you know, and, and showed me showed me how it is about how to go about myself, how to carry about myself. So I must say Denzel has uh, helped me a long way that. His message for the Trinidad and Tobago public as he exits international football, get behind the team. We have World Cup qualifying coming in 2026. We have a good shot at that, you know, so we should start to stick behind the team all now, you know. They are going to be ups, they are going to be downs, you know, but just don't be behind the team when the team on the up. Let us we come together as a public and come together as fans, you know, stick behind the team and, and help the team um, as the 12th man off the field. Kent Fuentes, TTT Sports. Well, we wish Marvin all the very best in his new chapter in his life.